the thing I recommend you do is listen very carefully because your tone is really in your fingers. It's not so much a product of the amp or the effects and stuff that you're using. It's the product of what you're hearing in your head to actually find that sweet spot. And if you see I'm turning the pick, you can hear different, different tones. So I look for... Look for that tone that sounds good to you. But what I'm listening for is for every note to come out clean. And if you try to play too fast and you screw it up, slow down. Because you'll sound bad when you start playing fast for the rest of your life. <laughs> so the ticket is play slow and perfect and make it sound good slow. And that's how you become, it's one of the ways of becoming a virtuoso. So you start really slow and clean and perfect. And then you slowly get faster. Now that's, you know, if you're interested in doing this kind of thing. Uh, the guitar or any instrument is a personal expression and it's all good. It is really all good. And even if you're just playing those few chords, you know, um, because it's subjective in the sense that um, the listener is the one that's judging and you're the one that's judging. And um, there's something to go around for everybody. And it's about finding your audience. You're only going to be really good at what's natural to you and you're most excited at. So if you think that you have to go play another kind of music like pop music or something and that it's a sellout, well I got news for you. There's people who play pop music and are really good at it because that's what they really like. And you're competing with them, you know, and uh, don't compete with them, compete with yourself. And if you love pop music, great. I, I like it, but I, I prefer what I do. So when you find what it is that you like, Keep it, keep it in the forefront of what you're doing, and that's going to give you your best success. Um, the, way, the, way that I, the reason why I play the way I play and sound the way I sound is because that's all I ever thought about my whole life. And uh, that's what was important to me. And it's an ongoing evolution. The best thing I would tell you is to try to find those unique things in your playing that you haven't heard and then exaggerate them. That's what I do. I find my strengths and I exaggerate them. I don't focus on my weaknesses. Not at all. I only focus on my strengths. Within my strengths, there's weaknesses.